if we divide 6 by 2, we get 3. And again dividing 6 by 2 also gives 3. In the end, dividing 3 by 3 results in 1. But this final answer is not correct, because we did not follow one of the most important rules in mathematics, which is, the order of operations. The order of operations tells us that when we are faced with a mathematical expression, we are not allowed to start solving it from anywhere we like. Instead, we must perform the operations in a specific order in order to reach the correct answer. This is known as the correct order of operations. The correct order of operations is commonly summarized by a short and well-known acronym called PEMDAS, where each letter represents a specific step in solving a mathematical expression. In some countries, the terms BODMAS or BIDMAS are used instead of PEMDAS. It is important to note that these three terms have no differences at all and are simply different names for one single mathematical rule. P stands for parentheses, and B stands for brackets. E stands for exponents, while O stands for orders, and I stands for indices. M and D stand for multiplication and division. And A and S stand for addition and subtraction. According to PEMDAS, we first calculate the parentheses, then we calculate the exponents, after the exponents we perform the multiplications and divisions, and finally we do the additions and subtractions. Multiplication and division have equal priority, so whenever both appear in an expression, move from left to right and perform whichever you reach first. This rule also applies to addition and subtraction. With these explanations in mind, let's move on to solving the question from the beginning of the video. But before we do that, please make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any future videos. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments, I'll be happy to answer. In the expression 6 divided by 2 divided by 6 divided by 2, there is more than one division. Since all of these division operations have the same priority, according to PEMDAS, we must move from left to right and perform the divisions in order. Therefore, we first perform this division, then this one, and finally the last division. 6 divided by 2 gives us 3. And the expression becomes 3 divided by 6 divided by 2. Then, 3 divided by 6 gives us 3 over 6. Since 3 divided by 3 equals 1, and 6 divided by 3 equals 2, 3 over 6 simplifies to 1 over 2. Finally, we calculate 1 over 2 divided by 2. To solve this part of the question, we use the KCF rule. K stands for keep, C stands for change, and F stands for flip. Here's how it works, keep the first number as it is, change the division sign to multiplication, flip the second number, take its reciprocal. According to the KCF rule, we keep 1 over 2 as it is. Division is changed to multiplication, and 2 is flipped and becomes 1 over 2. Finally, 1 over 2 multiplied by 1 over 2 gives us 1 over 4. So, our final answer is 1 over 4. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, like the video, if you have any questions, ask them in the comments, and I will definitely answer. Share it with your friends. And subscribe to the channel.